and uh, toss it at the scout. All right. The uh, hit will now be 2d8 damage instead of 1d8. Oh, I forgot about that. Thank you for correcting me on that one. Mm-hmm. Okay, so 1d20 plus 5 plus 2. That is versus armor class? Yeah. That hits? Okay, and it's not even, so I don't get my sneak attack. That is an even. That's a natural attack roll. Oh, it's even. an even. It's the base one. Oh, you're yes, right. Yes, it's the, it's the one you roll. Okay, so that's 2d8. However, one of your uh, allies yeah. is not engaged with the target, so you still wouldn't get your sneak attack. Oh, touche. Touche. Forgot about that one. Thank you. So that's 2d8 plus... Five. Yes. Woo! That's a spork. All right, go ahead and describe your spork attack more. Right. So what happens is Tempest is starts moving, and you can hear something jangling away in one of his pockets. He reaches in, he pulls out a spork, and he looks at it and goes, oh, I was hoping for something a bit better, and throws it as he's darting over in an attempt. He saw this scout, he saw his sneaky maneuvers, he didn't figure it out, but he saw his sneaky maneuvers, and he figured that that's a target to try and take out urgently. So as he's darting, he throws the spork, you know, figuring it might distract him. Instead, it goes straight through the armor and embeds itself in his shoulder, yes. realizing he might have thrown that a bit harder than he expected to. You have staggered the scout, and uh, he roars again in anger and pain. Leon, it's your turn. We'll move here, looking over to the sorcerer, and decide that two can play at that game, raising his blade into the air, air and as he does so, dark energy just swirling as he gathers power. Okay. Uh, I also get I also get a chaos blessing, uh, which will be damage to damage equal to one nearby enemy. He gets two damage. Okay. So as I gather as I gather power, the dark moat swirling ar swirling around, almost in the distance. You know, other than feeling the necrotic power, you almost almost like a, a faint crack of lightning goes here. As you as you also see, some of this dark energy kind of recoil off and sliver across the ground and strike at the scout. Power clearly being gathered qu quickly. The next attack should do a lot of damage. This bugbear moves to this position as a double move. Perhaps trying to get the flank on you. Sneaky. And uh, let me go ahead and add Dirtle Hullenford to your escalation die and set his value to... No, not toggle hold. No, not move me on. <laughs> <laughs> Did we get this right? Come on. There we go. Good job, Dirtle. Bugbear Scout's turn is again... Well, there's a lot of fucking pain that just flew his way. Fuck all of that shit. <laughs> From a spork. All right. Uh, he is going to move and engage Tempest. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, I have to have momentum. Yes, Give me a second to at least have, enable that. Yeah, you have that. momentum. Uh, my momentum thing has disappeared, but I might ask um, I can make Leon it. to make that, but I'll just put the state on. Uh, vulnerable. Leon, make me a macro. Yes. What? I'll do it. So, <laughs> so you have that, uh, that, uh, that macro. Well, you had it. Where the fuck did it go? Was it on your last token that was just deleted? You had the button it, that you could click, and boom. You it, yes, it was. Oh. <sighs> yeah, I'm, I'm re recreating it. All right. I'm sorry. Anyway, uh, he goes ahead and attacks you. That will be 13 points of damage due to a stealthy uh, maneuver. Roll with it. Okay, that will be 6 points of damage, then. And you lose your momentum. I lose my momentum anyway. Yes. <laughs> As the scout, uh, in pain and angry, lifts a flanged mace and strikes Tempest in the shoulder with it. Tempest finds a way to make it more of a glancing blow, but is still stricken quite badly. Fargus, it is your turn. Alright. Fargus will uh, move over here and slam his spear into the ground. Okay. Casting Ruination. Alright. That does manage to hit all three bugbears. That's good. <laughs> That's good. That's good. That's a wave of force uh, flies out uh, around Fargus. Okay. You have attracted the attention of the bugbears. <laughs> yep. <laughs> so much that so that uh, 
that uh, this bugbear, uh, you know, he, he looks over at Fargus, and uh, because uh, Tempest is engaged, he can't stop that as a move action. This bugbear will uh, move on over and say greetings and salutations to Fargus. Hello. Hello. <laughs> However, he misses with his oversized weapon. Oh. Hmm. Oversized weapon. <laughs> Dwohirum's turn. I really don't want the sorcerer to do bad stuff, but uh, <laughs> that's not the really thing I can do, you know? Is that really? I can't really take responsibility for that sort of thing. No. That's right. It's, it's not like an <laughs> anime or whatever, like a Japanese manga. You will not accept responsibility. <laughs> sure. All right. So, uh, so I guess I'll I'll go here and uh... separate yourself. I like it. <laughs> Gotta keep moving, right? <laughs> Split the party. They can't kill all yeah. of us. I also got to be close if I want to attack him. Which, which I, I guess I'll do. I'll, I'll cast a ray of frost on him. All right. Somehow I feel this would be woefully ineffective. That's against uh, physical defense. Physical defense. That oh, is that a hit. Actually, hmm. I figured his would be lower than the uh, guys. Yeah. Okay. All right. You manage to hit. The sorcerer's turn. He'll uh, step up here, mm. look down at the uh, group of three, but he can only target one of them. He chooses Leon. Okay. Uh, as uh, he lets out a orb of chaos versus Leon's mental defense, that will be 16 points of lightning damage. Mm-hmm. And uh, that is a natural even hit, so he gains one use of your racial power, if any. You just can't use it this turn. <laughs> but my racial power gets to reroll initiative. <laughs> he'll uh, he'll he'll he'll, he, he'll take the better result next turn. He was hoping for a bit more, but he only rolled a d3, a one on a one d3 for him, enemy targeting. He will sadly end his turn. Thomas, it is your turn. I can inform well, you. He is toast. First of all, quick action. Tempest, make an attack. Uh, Tempest. Also, uh, weren't, uh, weren't that 8 lightning damage instead of 16? Wait, well... No, that's, he, that's, gathered that's, that's, he gathered power. That's double damage. Oh, all right. Yes, also is doubling. Double yeah. damage when they do it. That's an 18. Uh, that is so enough need, to hit... So, oh. One second. I need to roll an extra 1d8 on that. There you go. With an extra 1 <laughs> damage on it. I forgot to change <laughs> that macro. Sorry. Okay. Uh, 13 points of damage. Uh, the uh, bugbear scout is heavily injured, but he remains standing. Uh, all right, then Thomas will move here, engage the bugbear scout, and try to smack him. <laughs> try, he Two tried. Damage. But you're Two engaged. Damage. You're engaged with it. That's the fun part. All right, Tempest, you're up. Tempest uh, realizes this. Is going a bit more bizarre, you know. Thing, thing attacks him, smacks his shoulder. That, that's not, that's not cricket. But he also has momentum because he hit the thing. So with the momentum, he's going to get his wrench, wind up a good solid hit, and aim for his chin with the deadly thrust. He's a standard non staggered non move enemy. On the plus five, plus two, plus two. Yeah. That hits his armor class. Well, 2d8 plus... Oh, I'm just I know, to... man, okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's not cricket. It's not uh, cricket at uh, all. No, I can't remember what the sneak attack damage for a level 2 is, but I think it's 1d6. Should uh, be 1d6. 1d6 or 1d8. Uh, you, do you have improved sneak attack, yes or no? I have. Yes, I have. You have improved sneak attack? Okay, improved sneak attack, you have 1d8 at level 2. Oh, one uh, by the way, do you get sneak attacks on melee basic attacks too? Ye only once per round, and only if it was engaged with another enemy do I get sneak attack. You weren't engaged when you gave me that. Yeah, I, I could have done it the other way around is what I'm saying. Yeah, if you were engaged with it when I hit it, then yes. But only once per round. Which is not oh, now. Well. It's probably dead. 
that is just enough damage. 23 hit points remaining. Tempest mm. fells the bugbear. That's your basic attack? No, that wasn't. That was his deadly thrust. <laughs> Alright, good. <laughs> to say. Which is actually still my basic attack plus sneak attack. Damage wise, but yeah, yeah it's better. a lot of damage. It's because his dice have scaled already. I'll scale next level. So you deadly yeah. thrust with a wrench. That's not. You do realize that's not a purse piercing weapon, right? Tempest, you're doing it wrong. <laughs> it has. It's got sharp tips. Oh, deadly swing. I'll show you who's got sharp tips. Wait, this. <laughs> Leon, oh. you're up. Let me teach you about being a sorcerer. I move up and engage. Okay. <laughs> As you do. That's what sorcerers do. Because I can I can do this just fine. I don't know if he can cast any spells here, but I can. And you know what? I'm not in a good mood. You just hit me. So, um Yeah. Yeah. This be fun. Uh one target. Well that's gonna be the sorcerer. Okay. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do this, which we be D20 plus... Uh, we've got one dice right now for... Yeah, escalation dice escalation. one. That is 16 versus physical defense. That hits. Very well. Six plus four. That is 28 points of cold damage. Yes. As Leon goes ahead and, with his sword, stabs it into the ground, causing it to almost split open and shards of ice to fly out and crash into... To the blue sorcerer. Alright, he is not uh, dead, but he is most certainly staggered. Yes. I have my sword ready to whack him around the face if I need to. Anything else? Um, I do not have anything I can do with my quick action right now. Okay. Well, I, I know you, you reflavored the spell, but I do like using a breath weapon against the blue sorcerer. I like the irony. Well, yes. well, this bugbear was thinking about going to, like, party maybe with that wizard down there. Then this fucking S S Leon just rolled up here. Bugbear, yeah. Bugbear's like, fuck this. I'm going after this guy. I can hit this bastard. Okay. So he'll uh, move up to Leon. That will be a hit. Uh, that is a natural even, so that deals 15 damage instead of 10. Mm -hmm. Okay, he'll go ahead and re-roll the attack. That is a natural even. Take your 15 damage. <laughs> you know, it was worth a try, right? Absolutely, it was worth a try. I agree I with that. The shield. Would have been even funnier if it created. <laughs> it was possible. <laughs> I had considered that outcome. The shield oh. goes up and it deflects it right into his face. Yeah. <laughs> yes. I had considered that outcome already. The bug barrel lifts oh. his oversized cudgel and uh, even through the... Uh, the shimmering, like, reflective field of Leon powers through it with brute strength and says, You no scare me, puny human. <laughs> Escalation goes to two. Oh, I forgot my plus one. The bugbear scout is dead. Vargas, you're <laughs> up. You are currently engaged with a bugbear. He put a yes. ring on you. It's like Roald oh. Archook. <laughs> oh, I like it. Uh, yeah, I will like, attempt to disengage. Okay. To end the arrangement. That is a success. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you, with a flourish, disengage. <laughs> Ta -da! You get a teleport. You bump over here. Oh, <laughs> uh, exactly. And then I'm gonna move. No, I'm gonna stay here, actually. Okay. And, uh, hmm. Cast a spark on the blue sorcerer. Okay. That is a hit, and that's a kill. Sweet. The sorcerer falls burbling hisses as his body collapses. As Fargus uh, celebrates with some jumping and screaming. <laughs> I, I don't know. I'm too tired. <laughs> hey, get back here! The bugbear... <laughs> the bugbear attempts to intercept... Like, to, attempts to engage Fargus, then Tempest intercepts uh, misses. Whoosh. That will be I, the I end. I was too busy to imagine Fargus jumping and screaming and victory <laughs> to intercept. Ah! Well, hear him. It is your turn. Uh, none of these bugbears damage, right? 
they've been slightly damaged by Fargus's ruination. Oh, yeah, right. They both took the same. Basically, damage. let's let's take the one over there that's already close to me first. I'll I'll rear frost it. Okay. Good old rear frost. That does not hit the bugbear's physical defense. All right. Oh, Two points of damage. <laughs> <laughs> See if it does. That does not hit the bugbear's physical defense. <laughs> oh, does it? No. no, no. <laughs> you only have so many command points here. Whenever someone fails to hit with a com reroll command, do it again. <laughs> That'd be a good feat. All right. That's your standard action. Do you wish to move? Uh, no, I'm good. Okay. Sorcerer is dead. Thomas, it's your turn. Uh, let's... That one? Sure, let's go here and right. punch that one. Punch him? Alright. Or at least hack at Here you have some experience with that. <laughs> <laughs> yes! If I try to imagine him as a priest. That does, <laughs> that does not hit the bugbear's armor class. Alright. You do not need from the front. Sword next. Thomas, uh, Tom, it is the end of Thomas' turn. Tempest, you're up. Alright, so let's think. You're not staggered. You're still standing. Stand still, human! <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, you, you've decided what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, right, roll. <laughs> Stand still, and I'll have you know. <laughs> this is not a human you're facing, but... <laughs> oh, oh, you missed me there. <laughs> As he's ducking and weaving the swings that's being thrown at him. And two plus two for the escalation. That hits the bugbear's armor class. And that's two D eight plus five. Eight. All right. The bugbear takes eight points of damage. And disengage. That's a success. They go ah, 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 and then right back into. Him. <laughs> <laughs> In an attempt to confuse him. Hell, actually, screw it. Let's make this interesting. As a part of me coming back, as my quick action, I am going to leap on top of his head with a finger and land on the other side to totally daze him with my acrobatics. Yes, he certainly counts as dazed. <laughs> the minus four to his attack rolls until the end of your next turn. He doesn't get to save that. He's like, he like looks <laughs> above him. He's like, eyes still in the sky. Where'd he go? Yeah. <laughs> and, like he wheels his head around. Oh! <laughs> I am amused. I will crush you. <laughs> oh come on, try, do try. Leon, it's your turn. Okay, so I do not recharge the breath weapon yet. Mm -hmm. That's fine. Um. Well, hello, Mister Bugbear. Hello. <laughs> Can I disengage with you? No. You've lost your movement. I'm gonna keep you. <laughs> he put a ring on it. He did put a ring on it. I'm gonna um, roast you on a spit. <laughs> and I don't have a stick. I'll find one. He points to the blue sorcerer's spear as a free action. <laughs> <laughs> Was drinking a to, to drink? Did, did a drinking potion not provoke? It, it does not provoke. No. I'm going to drink a potion. Put okay. it right in front of his face. All right. That's a uh, you get your normal recovery plus an extra one d eight. Oof. Fourteen. Alright, that's the end of Leon's turn. I almost recovered the damage from when he hit me. Yes. The bugbear engaged with Leon's like, You think puny drink will save you? <laughs> Stand still! <laughs> <laughs> he says that, just steps out of the way. <laughs> you know fight fair. <laughs> That's the end of the bugbear's turn. Escalation die goes to three. Bugbear scouts dead. Fargus, you're up again. Presuming you are here. Muted. Pointing arrow. Got it. You're targeting him. God damn it. That's <laughs> <laughs> fucking that guy. Alright. Uh, what's the escalation die? Three? Three. Right? Yeah. That, that is a hit against his physical defense. <laughs> Eight points of lightning damage. Got it. Yep. Oh, 19. So he is still not staggered. Damn it. Bugbears are very tough. Uh, I, I see that. 
That's your standard <laughs> action. You want to move? Um, no. Okay. Don't know. I don't hide behind the wizard. No, it's fine. All right. Maybe, maybe you're no fun. Maybe I'm just gonna leave you now. You just fucking. <laughs> Bugbear like mutters curses as he successfully <laughs> disengages from Tempest. I, God damn it! Oh, that's a successful disengage. Yes. No way. Yes, I'll, wait. I'll be right back. I'll wait for you. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> He's Dave, though. This, so. this, this is a, a minus four to his attack roll. That's a ten versus armor class. <laughs> <laughs> it's the snow <laughs> with the sign of Fargus. <laughs> What's he even doing? <laughs> Shut up! Don't judge me with your human words! He swings, oh. misses, and the force of the blow makes him Could spin someone... around in the snow. Can someone stagger that one for me? Duo here, I'm at your turn. <laughs> Mana is muted. Yes, that, that, that's minimum damage. That uh, Gosh. that does hit the bugbear, and uh, mm. let's see here. That is not enough to stagger him. Absolutely. Oh, Grimith, you're getting good at this whole sort of suspense. I can't tell if it's a good or a bad. We'll step over here. <laughs> also, minimum damage. Sure deal with that. Yes. I will say That's that the if, power of the wizard, yeah. if he had dealt one oh. more point of damage, that would have staggered him. Hmm. Not quite a kill skill still, but anyone want to stagger? Sorcerer He's is like dead. distracted looking through the forest, like this is the perfect time for an ambush. Thomas, He's out here. It is your <laughs> turn. Leon just drank a healing potion and the bugbear missed. Okay, well, Thomas isn't going to miss for <laughs> the tenth time in a row, right? Alright. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> However, two damage. Yes. I don't even know. No, do you remember no. the escalation die at all? Yes. Yes. So that's an attack roll of one. Miss damage does not get applied. Yes, that is a one. fumble. Uh, oh, I don't actually have the escalation die in there, but that is a miss regardless. Yes. You should have the escalation die. Tempest, it is your turn. The uh, bugbear whom you have confused just said, "Fuck you." I'm gonna go out. However, in his dazing, he may have made a mistake. Yeah, swing somewhere Tempest, over here. Tempest is going to sort of, you know, jog over, tap his shoulder, and attempt to go, Ah, wait, I have one thing to ask. That's right. In, in, in this foolery, he may have engaged with another enemy, thus giving you your sneak attack. <laughs> oh, it's tempting to steal something, but I really should aim for the damage. Uh, you can steal yeah. from his body once you're dead. <laughs> He's yeah. not going to live long well, wait, enough to be upset. I'm dead? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know... <laughs> Alright, you know what? I'll do another tumbling strike on him. Alright. 1d20 plus 3 plus 5 plus 2. That does Ooh, not oh. hit and you get nothing. Ooh. Oh, I, I just wanted to give you a bit of a breeze, old chap. Well, uh, well that wasn't it, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, we're out of command points. But you heard that one. Uh, <laughs> Plus three, plus five, plus two. Oh, sorry, that was a bit of a breeze. Here, let me try again. That is also <laughs> not a hit. <laughs> Whoosh! Oh, I'm giving you but, but, but that does deal miss damage, and that does stagger him. <laughs> I, I clipped him with take the tip it. of the wrench. <laughs> <laughs> and he's no longer staggered. Oh, yes, he's no longer dazed, but he is staggered, yes. That's the one, even. <laughs> Leon, it's your turn. Let's have a... Uh, oh, first thing, recharge roll. Yes. I guess you do that every round. That's a successful recharge. Well, this is recharged. Well, I know what's coming now. Another frozen fish up. Hey, uh, let's talk about this. No. <laughs> what's the escalation die? Three. Three. Um, first of this physical defense. That does manage to hit his physical defense. Very well. With, eno with another grounding of the sword and more icicles, 16 points of cold damage fires out at him. All right. It does hit. He uh, gets angrier. <laughs> Unfortunately, I do not disengage. So I'll kind of just whisk around here. Alright. We're gonna try this again, alright? Stop whisking around. Stop breathing your icicles on me. And die! <laughs> that, oh. is a, mm, that, that is... Oh. That is... 30 th points of damage, I'm out. 30 points of damage... <laughs> The bugbear is highly satisfied that you have chosen to follow his directive. <laughs> <laughs> I will take that 30 points of damage and disappear. Ooh. Puts you at negative 7. You are dying. I acknowledge this. The escalation die goes to 4.
The bugbear Thomas is engaged with looks imminently pleased with himself. You're not dead. That's a dying symbol, not the dead symbol. Yeah, okay. I know. It's just uh, a dramatic book. Yes. Fargus. How do you save someone who's dying? Uh, so, uh... You would have to, I like... You could, like, try to, like, make, like, a heal check against them, or you could force feed them a healing potion as a standard action. Uh, I'll yeah. handle it. No, oh, sure. Um, I didn't really want to use a daily here. Uh, I'm not really sure now, though. We really need to. Don't Should blow the daily. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm not gonna do that, but... Hmm. Uh. We've Am got... I gonna disengage? He's before Griff, so yes. Uh, yeah, I'm... yeah, I'm gonna try to disengage. Okay. We have more recoveries than we have dailies, so that is a successful yep. disengage. All right, and I will move to. Uh, I move here. Okay. <laughs> and then I'll cast. Um, let's see. I'll cast Spark on the uh, staggered bugbear. Okay. That is a fucking hit, yes. <laughs> That's the second 19 in a row. Yep. That is a second. How about 19? Is 19 good enough for you? <laughs> and 8 damage again. Hmm. Yes. That's you know, if I'm taking roll, away all the low rolls, I'm, I'm content. Right. Alright, if you insist, the bugbear wheels around to uh, glare at Tempest. <laughs> Whoosh. <laughs> oh, it seems you've learned from my school of fanning each other, huh? The bugbear ends his turn frowning. Because he sees that other bugbear and how successful he is. <laughs> it to be that bugbear. <laughs> we'll hear him. It's your turn. Go here. And, uh, you know, I'm going to do the rear frosting. Okay. There we go. That is a hit. Uh, the bugbear with whom Tempest is engaged is almost dead. Not a ton of damage, but... Thomas, it's your turn. Okay, Thomas will not hit the bugbear. He'll try to kind of distract him or something while he weighs the odds, and... God damn it. <laughs> you did not weigh the odds correctly. Yeah. Or, nor did you distract. Well, We're losing. It's difficult to do while trying to dance with a bugbear. <laughs> and that will be his turn. Okay. Tempest, it's your turn. Alright, Tempest is, you know, ducking and weaving with Jaws, and the bugbear is ducking and weaving even when it was dazed. <laughs> um, so, you know, he's, he flicks the wrench, you know, does a sort of a nice pirouette with the wrench, and does an upper swing with it. So, uh, all right. roll 1d20, plus 5, plus 2, plus 2, plus 4. Whoa! <laughs> well, crit. you go ahead and give me a description here. This bugbear has nine <laughs> hit points. You're killing him. Oh <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, so, there we go. Yes. All right, so he, you know, as um, Tempest is ducking you, he goes, "Here, let me show you a bit of a tip when you actually want to hit what you're watching, Mister Bear." Ha! Ah, now see, what you do is you have to make it look fancy, and he flicks it right. No, he is ducking and weaving while this is going on, going, ah, no, upper a bit, no, no, don't listen to what I'm saying, oh, you should have listened, you should have listened, you should have done this! And he swings the wrench, aiming for, again for the chin, it seems to be a bugbear's weak spot. And he clips the chin, and the wrench actually goes into the head, and he pops the jaw out with the wrench, and he goes, oh, Bit too effective there, mate. Uh, sorry. Uh, seems the, I've took it a souvenir. The bugbear <laughs> gives a look of shock and disbelief before he cl collapses dead. <laughs> that is your standard action. You still have a move action. And. Move to engage! And you have your momentum. Oop. Leon, make a death save for me. What, 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 the, what the hell? You just like fucking just like <laughs> I just throw all D20s. What does it work? Well, <laughs> that's uh, my recharge one, that's my death's door. Both are success. Well actually the recharge is not the death's door is. Uh death's door, uh that is a success. You are able to uh heal using a normal recovery as if you were at zero hit points, of course. And uh you're still prone on the ground, and uh that'll be your turn. Mm-hmm. The bugbear. The last standing bugbear. Look eyes like Thomas, and he eyes Tempest, and he eyes Thomas, in fact, a Tempest, and then he realizes that Thomas has been completely ineffective thus far this entire. <laughs> and uh, the bugbear uh, lifts his oversized weapon and tries to go after Tempest. Isn't that right, Train? Oh no, it's not the train! However, the bugbear's oversized weapon goes over Tempest's head. 
Oh no no no! I take four damage. What we haven't noticed That's thus right. far is that the no, bugbear no, is no, actually no, no. wielding a train. So you do not That's take you four are damage. The, you're the target. If you're engaged with two or more foes, but you're not. Oh, yes. right. Okay, right. I, I didn't know the terminology if it was against the bugbear or against me. See, the escalation die goes to five. There's only one enemy left remaining. One enemy left remaining? Yes, totally redundant. Fargus, it's your turn. Yes, uh, Tesla Tower. 